This is a brief demonstration to help you get started using the library's online card catalog. I'm going to look for books of literary criticism as an example. If you need to pause or replay any parts, you can use the controls on your screen. To go directly to the catalog, use the URL on the screen, colin.polarislibrary.com. There's a link to the catalog inside Cougar Web on the Library tab and also on the Library page on the main Colin website, www.colin.edu. Here's the opening catalog screen. Notice it looks like a web search engine, but instead of searching the web here, you're going to use a catalog to find what's on the library shelves at all of our campuses. The catalog defaults to a keyword search initially, and that can return a lot of content that may be irrelevant. I'm going to limit the search to subject, so there will be less to look through. I'm going to change this drop-down box. That way I'll just find materials about the life and work of Tim O'Brien. On this next screen are the results of my search. In this case, mostly books of literary criticism about Tim O'Brien's writing. Notice that the information you need for your Works Cited page is available here. Title of the book, author's name, and publication information. So everything you need to cite what you're using is available. To find out which campus library has this book, you click the Location button. Here you can see that Preston Ridge owns a copy. Circulating book means it can be checked out. And the call number is how you find it on the shelf. Colleges and universities usually use the Library of Congress call numbers. They look a little different than the Dewey Decimal number you see in a high school or a public library. Copy it all down from the letters to the date, and then you can go to the shelf to find the title. And the good thing about literary criticism is that once you find the right place on the shelf using the call number, books written by the author as well as about the author are all in the same place. So biographies, literary criticism, along with what the author wrote is all there. So you don't have to go all over the library looking for what you need. And you can focus on picking the best sources from what's there on the shelf for the topic that you're writing about. If you have any questions about Colin Library online resources, feel free to contact me. Good luck with your research. If you need proof that you viewed this tutorial for a lab credit or other assignment, you can download or print a certificate of completion at the URL on your screen.